how to trade the US dollar versus the Canadian dollar before the Bank of Canada, before the BOC. Please take a short moment to read the risk disclaimer. It is very important. Also, if you want to join our VIP Telegram group to get full services, to get all our signals, you can click on the link posted right below this video. Also, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. It is very important. You can like, comment and share our videos. Also, follow us on Instagram. Thank you, guys. So let's take a look here on the economic calendar and you can see that tomorrow the BOC will, the Bank of Canada will publish and will release its over, overnight rate, which is expected to remain steady at 0.25%. Also the BOC, the Bank of Canada rate statement could bring some volatility to tomorrow. So. This event, this high impact event could bring sharp movements on the US dollar versus the Canadian dollar. The Bank of Canada, it is expected to maintain its monetary policy unchanged. So let's take a look here. And as you can see, the US dollar versus the Canadian dollar continues to move sideways only because maybe the traders are expecting something from tomorrow's BOC meeting. Also, maybe they are expecting for maybe a bullish spark to be able to maybe confirm a potential upside reversal here. So right now we are still in a range here in a sideways movement in the short term. So we'll really have to wait for confirmation here, guys, before really maybe deciding to take action, to go long or to go short. So right now the price of the US dollar versus Canadian dollar has tested and retested the, the pivot point, 1.2069. Right now it has managed to close above 1.2106 former high, confirming maybe a potential growth towards the weekly resistance R1, 1.2133. But still, I believe that the price could maybe register a potential upside reversal only if the rate will maybe make a valid breakout, an upside breakout from this range here. Okay, so we have a range and we have to wait for an upside breakout to go long and maybe for a valid breakdown to get confirmation that this pair could resume its downside movement its downtrend okay so right now it's risky to buy it from here only because we have this strong resistance area here so personally i would like to see something like this i've told you maybe a sideways movement here and also if the price will make a valid breakout to jump close and stabilize above these former highs above the R1 above 1.2141 before confirming a further drop so such a potential valid breakout upside breakout from this range could really signal a potential bullish reversal in the short term and we'll have maybe upside targets here at the 38.2 retracement level 1.2257 also the R3 the 50% 1.2333 guys so let's wait and see and i really hope that tomorrow's meeting could really bring us a breakout from this pattern and maybe it will bring us a new buying opportunity thank you guys and if you wanted the signal for this pair us dollar versus canadian dollar you can join our vip telegram group by accessing this link here or by accessing the link posted right below this video learn to trade go premium also please subscribe to our youtube channel you can comment share and like our videos here is our website learn to trade please follow us on instagram guys we have a lot of content there as well vip content thank you guys